Hey, welcome back to Cover That Roof. We're in Palos Verdes Estates, and we had some heavy winds the other night, and we're replacing some wind damage. Broken tiles, you can see them. Shattered, these, this row of three tiles is completely blew off. Broken tiles scattered throughout. We're gonna get them all fixed, and this is how we do it. First, we wanna remove the broken tiles. Then we wanna put some mastic over the nail hole to get it sealed up, and then we can slip another tile back into its place. So let's see how we do it. picked up and out of the way so we know what we have to do while we're doing our repair. So let's see how we do it. Okay, so now that we got most of these tiles in this section pulled out, now we want to put a nail back into the nail hole from the tile that we just pulled out to ensure that we know that it's not going to leak through that spot. And then we're going to come back and put a little sealant on it and put the tile back in place and it should work out just fine.
Okay, so that looks pretty nice. Now we want to come up and make sure that the rows of tiles are straight. Okay, so everything looks good. We want to get that nailed off. Now we want to get the next row on. Let's get some nails in that and get it nailed off. Okay, so we just want to continue filling in the blanks. Let's do it. out pretty great. We got all the tiles fixed in this area. We got the broken ones removed. The nail back in the old nail hole. Some sealant on top of the new nail. And we slid the tile right back into place. We nailed the tiles where we could, as you saw, but when we had it filled in and then there's only one row left, we can only put the sealant underneath the tile and then slide the tile underneath. And the sealant acts as a liquid nail, which is great. Gonna pin it in, hold it in place, and we're gonna move on 
We'll do some other tiles around the house. We'll catch up to you a bit and we got something more to show you. We'll see you in a bit. Yeah, we ran out of tile. Yeah, we have some, yeah, that one right there, don't worry, we're gonna get that one. That, um, we're out of tile. For the S yes tile, but yeah, this one right here, absolutely. We call that a top. Yeah. A ridge tile, exactly, you see? You know what you're talking about. Okay, so that came out pretty awesome. Pretty excited about this. We'll catch up to you a bit when we have more to show you. So I hope you enjoyed this episode of how to repair wind damage S-tile. Hope you enjoyed this. Hope you enjoyed this episode of how to repair wind damage on an S-tile roof. We'll catch up to you in a bit when we have more to show you.